Fire officials reminding you, maybe not a good day to press your luck. Yeah, absolutely. It's the time of year, and it brings all sort of fire dangers. And you need to protect, of course, your family and yourself. Yeah. News Force Katie Alexander live for us at the Frontier Volunteer Fire Company with what you need to know, Katie. Well, Mel and Jordan, uh, we've been talking a lot about fire safety this morning, uh, making sure you're visible when you're out trick or treating, and of course, the fire dangers that come with things like open flames. This is Rich Silveroli. He is the past chief here. What are we doing? Uh, well, we just want to show how important it is to have uh, don't have your costumes next to any type of open flame. Obviously, this one up front here with the little candles is kind of melting more than anything. But yet, even if it melts, it's going to get on your skin. You're going to get a nice serious burn. Uh, a lot of these things are somewhat type of uh, fire resistant, but doesn't mean that they won't catch on fire. Well, and especially when we're talking about the melting fabric, you can just imagine the burns when that stays on your skin. What's your big advice to people? This, once again, to stay away from t any type of open flames. Watch what you're doing, uh, especially if you're having a bonfire or you're having some type of, like I said, candles on a table. If you're reaching over, stuff could be hanging. You, you may have a wig on or a beard on that you normally don't have, um, <laughs> and it may actually catch on fire. As you can see, like I said, it's it's more smoldering than uh, anything, yeah, which is look good. Look at that front there. Yeah, um, but like you said, it, it's just going to melt on It's all plastic. So especially if you're out with your kids, it's so important to make sure that they're not getting too close to the jack-o'-lanterns, really staying away. Also, the fumes from this smell absolutely yeah, it's toxic. It's awful. <laughs> um, and, of course, if you do have a mishap, a good reminder for Fire Prevention Month to have uh, the fire extinguishers on yep. hand, everything that you need. Certainly a very scary situation, and we will continue to show you what you need to do to keep your family safe throughout the morning here on Wake Up. Make sure you stick with us over on the CW23. For now, reporting live, Katie Alexander, News 4. All right, good advice. They're also trending today.